That's Carrie Lake. And, uh, you know, there's an expression when people do something like that, right? You know, like when you curse out loud in public in front of people and it's kind of disgusting and disrespectful and wrong. And we all ask, do you kiss your mother with that mouth? I mean, in this case, does she hug her kids with those arms? That's disgusting. You don't do something like that in public. You don't act that way in public. But yet she's doing it. And, and I know, I know it's shock value. And some people are going to say, it's just shock value, Rick. You don't understand. In fact, George, put that up again. I mean, there it is. There, there she is with her arm in the air. I mean, she's, look at that. Hold that right there. It's shock value, right? She's just trying to tell everybody, oh, look at me. And she knows that when she does that, that it's going to make headlines all over the place. And it might. But there's something else involved in this, right? It's called decency. Think of all the women in your life, your mother, your grandmother, your daughter, your wife. Think of the people you know who are your best friends, who are women, who you respect. If you watch them do that in public, what would you think of them? Do you think they're serious? Would you think that they're serious? I mean, it's the same as shooting a bird in public. That's exactly the same, you know? I mean, that's, I guess, the Italian version of it or whatever, but it's the same exact thing. And we have to ask ourselves, you gotta be so hateful. You gotta be so angered. You gotta hate your enemy so much to go and do that in public rather than create an argument where you say that your opinion may be different than, their, than theirs. To do that, to do that. And then here's where this really becomes almost bizarre, almost ironically bizarre, almost conflictively bizarre. Here's a woman doing this vile gesture in public because she's basically wants her enemies ha to know, because that's for her enemies, the media, the press, whatever, Latinos, uh, liberals, I guess, Democrats, anybody who didn't vote for her, whatever. Just put them all together. That's, your, that's what she's saying to you, right? It's as vile, it's as disgusting, it's as despicable as you can get for a public figure to act like that. And of course, the people who are there are applauding. But then again, you know, people listen to morning talk shows and there's on the radio and they hear people doing that morning zoo stuff and outlandish stuff and they laugh and stuff. But I think this is different, no? I mean, she, she's in a public forum and she wanted to be the governor of a state and that's what she does. But wait, it gets better. We are Americans and we bow to one king and that is our creator, God. Can I get an amen on that one? Yeah. We got to bring God back, guys. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, you can't make this up. A woman who just did the bird signal with her arm told her enemies how much she hates them with the most vile gesture that you can do outside of maybe holding her crotch. I don't know. And now she says, it's about God. It's all about God. It's all about God, and we're Americans, and we're about God. Americans are not about that. Americans, we're not about that. And if you believe in a God who's greater than all of us and can help us find some sense of <laughs> solace in the world, I doubt that that's the signal that he would send. I just doubt it. I know it's like a Fellini, like a Fellini movie. Watching this move, this woman, but that's what we've come to, and I guess that's the virtue signal that she's sending these days. Carrie Lake, I'm Rick Sanchez. I do something called the Rick Sanchez Podcast. Check it out. You can find it on Agua Media. By the way, I want to thank Rebel HQ and TYT for giving me this opportunity to reach out to you. We'll see you soon.